Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I just came back from Walmart and before I put everything away, I wanted to show you guys what I bought. So starting over here with the frozen food, I picked up some Green Giant steamers and this is the seasoned Tuscan broccoli. And I love broccoli, but I have not tried um, any seasoned um, broccoli. So I wanted to give that a try. And we like corn around here, and this is the microwavable, microwavable steamer corn. It was 88 cents. And every time I go to Walmart, I always pick up their frozen meals, the, specifically the spaghetti with meat sauce. It is so good, and it's very inexpensive. It's $1.88, and I love to take these to work. And I also eat them here at home, of course. And it's a really hearty meal, and it does not taste like a frozen meal. It actually has, um, as you can see right there, Italian sausage, um, and it is really, really good. I mean, if you served it to someone outside of the package, um, outside of the package on a plate, they would have no idea that it was frozen. It's really that good. So I'm gonna be sad when everybody discovers it and the price goes up on it. Um, okay, so my deal of the day, was the pasta sauce. So for whatever reason, it was on clearance for $1.25 a bottle. So, um, and they don't expire until 2020 and 2019. So these um, are flavors that I haven't tried before. So the Prego Basil Pesto, the Artisan Three Cheese, Creamy Cheddar, Carbonara, and then the um, Barilla Spicy Marinara. Now the Barilla was actually $1.50, but all of the Prego and Bertoli, um, they were $1.25 on clearance. Then I grabbed some um, cheese because um, we're gonna have grilled cheese later on tonight. And I was thrilled to see these Cheeto, this new Cheeto product and they are for the summer, and they are stars in the, you can't see it, but it's Summertime Ranch, and I absolutely love ranch, ranch and I love cheese puffs, so I'm excited to try those. And also now I saw a new product, Jif Power Ups, and these are chewy granola bars, and they had different flavors like chocolate, and they had something else I can't remember, but I chose this one, the Creamy Peanut Butter. And then I love Nikot on my Dollar Tree hauls. I have showed you guys the peanut butter Nikots that I get. And um, this is a lemon cream, so I also love lemon and I love little crunchy cookies. So uh, grab some Nikot. Grab some bread for the grilled cheese sandwiches that we're having later. And also saw these um, icy slush little, um, you freeze them and they're like a slush. So I saw those and I got blue raspberry and cherry frost. All you do is throw them in the freezer and then you eat them and they taste like a slushy. So they're really good. Saw a couple of other new products that I haven't seen before. So this is in their kind of um, little healthy snack section. It's over typically by the deli. And so I saw um, cream coated and cookie crusted almond snacks and here's what they look like haven't tried them before but i'm excited to try them and then i saw another snack item in that same section and um it's banana brittle now i don't usually like bananas um, but this sounded really good um, it is let me show you the back let me show you what is in there so it has banana um, coconut sugar, peanut butter chips, oat flour, peanut flour, and some other stuff. But it's crunchy. It says creamy, nutty, and sweet. So I'm excited to try that. And let me see. Oh, the last thing that I picked up is Woman's World magazine. I typically tend to grab these at the checkout stand. They're pretty inexpensive, and they usually have some really good tips and recipes and different ideas, so I always grab um, one of those at the checkout counter. So this is my really quick Walmart haul. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please uh, give me a thumbs up and remember to subscribe. See you next time.